Okay. I don't have to move. It's your boy EJ, man. All right, took a break from looking at houses. It's driving me crazy. There's too much going on. It's too much. It's too much. Too much. The viewing tomorrow for another house. Right now, the housing market is, is going up and it's going down. It's going up and it's going down. Okay. So I don't have to move. Okay? I'm not evicted or no, 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 no shit like that. Everything's straight. But I know for my piece, I just need a little bit more. You know what I'm saying? More. I need more space in my house. Not necessarily the yard, the yard is straight. Like, I ain't tripping on the yard, but what I'm tripping on is the fact there's no trees, okay? Like there's no shade trees. All the, is it, ain't nothing, man. Everybody got one tree. You know what I mean? There's no trees around. And that's what's troubling me the most. That's why I had to fix this whole setup. I don't know if y'all remember. I had this whole setup with the, the five, you know what I'm saying? Straight, uh, but I had, to, I had to take it down, bro. It was just too hot. There were no shade trees. So my dogs was cooking. I came outside one time. My dog's head was swollen. It was like Chloe or Zeus. Their head was swollen. Even with the even with the shade and all, they just they couldn't cool off. And so I had to end up bringing them inside. Then I figured out the garage was a better center because I could use the, I can come through with the fans. I could put the fan on them. Because you can't hook the fan up outside. Not the one I had. So I could put the fan on them with the water and the mist and all that. It just was a better setup. But with that being said, with that setup, the setup is being exposed to the public. So that didn't work either. So um, I don't know, man. Anyway, I'm trying to find a place that has a, a, a high density of trees and all that. And we I actually did find a spot. But the house is a little dated, which makes sense. Like you can't get everything you want, so you gotta make some sacrifices on what you want for real. So you wanna update the house, update the house gonna come with flat land. It's not gonna come with a bunch of wooded area unless you build your house somewhere close to wood. Whenever somebody come put down new houses and clean the whole area, they don't leave the trees up. So if we want a, a house that's, that's you know got the trees and all that, then it's gonna be a little bit dated. These are the only boards I got right now, man. What's going on? Time to go to the store, man. Make a store run, man. It's another thing I like about the neighborhood, man. When you got these new developments and shit, it's always a little corner store, like. They always put gas station on the corner. There's always a bunch of food, cocos, wires, like everything always real close. You get into the older houses where, you know, there's a lot more spaces and trees and all that stuff. It's a little hike, you know what I'm saying, to the stove. Which ain't, it ain't bad. It's probably just like five, 10 minutes in a car, which is like 35, 40 minutes on a bike, 35, 30 minutes on a bike or something. And I love riding a bike. A lot of y'all don't know this, but I'm real into like, real deal into like being outside, man. <laughs> On the bikes, hikes, and all that type of stuff. So just being around a bunch of trees, it literally makes me feel good. Yo, TT in there, man. TT, chill out, man. You know you don't act right with the girls. Got this girl steady messing with my chicken. Shut up, my chicken, man. Get back. Chill out. Leave my chicken alone, man. Watch out. Get back. Get back. Um, they over there eating off the ground. Mm -hmm. 
For all y'all dog people that say dogs can't eat off the ground, dogs will take their food and put it on the ground. Um, got cookie out you? What our cookie? What's our cookie? We got Junior right there. We got Hazel right there. Hazel finna drop any day now, y'all. <laughs> hey, you finna drop any day now, man. You got dookie on your butt. That's the only thing I don't like about the Frenchies, man. When they dookie, they say you gotta wipe the dookie off for them or something. Sometimes. Sometimes they uh, rub their butt across the ground, but not often enough. Hey, Tom. Well, chill out, girl. I get on your ass. Cookie, chill out. Leave me alone. Leave me alone, Cookie. You already ate. Drop y'all. I'm telling y'all. I'm thinking Hayes is gonna come with them next week or so. Zeus, leave her alone. You got your own power over there. Soon as she leave that power, she's gonna try to go over there. I don't know, baby. Good nipples dropping, y'all. Oh my god. Oh my god. The girl, why she pregnant? Oh no. Oh no. Dang it. Terrible timing. Dang, y'all, the girl looking pregnant, dude. I was hoping, I, I was hoping it wasn't gonna look like this. And they looking, they looking kind of like her, just behind a little bit. Her is hanging low. She probably ready to come in the next week or so. I say next week, week and a half. I think she might even come next week. <clears throat> I'm thinking she might end up coming next week. If not next week, for sure the week after that. But she ain't, oh my God. Oh my God, bro, Katana. Damn. Y'all know Rossi finna drop. Rossi should drop within the next three weeks. A two week, two and a half weeks, three weeks. And then she should drop a week after that. So I'm thinking two weeks apart, I'm thinking she gonna come next week. I'm thinking she gonna come two weeks after that. And I'm thinking she gonna come two weeks after her. Oh my God. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. Yeah, and our appetite is picking up. Look at the stomach, bro. Like, this girl, real deal. Crack oh no. Damn. Damn. I got some stuff I gotta figure out, y'all. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. This video. It's time to build them weapon boxes.
Well, we're going to go see a house, me and my daughters. Um, it's, a, it's a bigger house, upstairs, downstairs, a lot more living space. Because as y'all know, man, I need the living space so I can uh, maintain the level of uh, care for my dog that I'm trying to maintain. I'm trying to do better. Like, if my house is bigger, my dogs would have never went in the garage. If my house is bigger, my dogs would have never came out here, bro. Like, it just, when you got a bunch of dogs, and you ain't little kids in the house, you gotta separate some things, man. Because everybody had a move, you know what I'm saying? Dogs might start fighting, because dogs, like, you know, they fight. There's a kid around, just anything. So, if I had a bigger house, there'd be more space where the dog mad at this dog, it'd go to the other side of the house. It won't have to engage it. Gonna go to the other side of the crib. Boy, I just tell it to go outside. Bigger house, more of a street.
All right, right now, right now I'm not letting Katana and Rossi out together. Uh, they fought because they was in the same kennel. Okay, was in the garage cleaning my kennels up on my way to deliver a couple of dogs to a client. Hazel, well not Hazel, but Katana and Rossi did get into an altercation, which left Katana neck super swole and all that. And Katana in return bit Rossi leg. Um, as we all know, Rossi is in full blown pregnancy. We halfway there. I don't need no mishap. I don't need her doing nothing too much crazy. I don't need her fighting. Tomorrow we'll go get a, a, a spot. So man, hopefully we get a new spot, get a bigger space. But if I still gotta stay here, I'm gonna make it work the best way I can. Hazel is 47 days pregnant. Um, I haven't did the numbers quite yet on Katana and Rocky, but it won't be hard to do. I can do it real quick. But we 47 days from, uh, we're 47 days pregnant, at least 47 days pregnant with Hazel. <laughs> Roxy and Zeus was five days locked after that, so we're just gonna say six days. Um, so that means Roxy is 41 days. She's 47 days pregnant, more or less. She's 40 days, 41 days pregnant, more or less. Maybe a day off, a day different, a day or two different. Uh, let's see about Hazel. I mean, Katana. Katana was hit that same day, too. So if Katana's pregnant, I think she's around. Prince did hit her again after that. So I think she's around 37. 37 to 41 days pregnant. All in all, these dogs are a week or two apart. You know what I'm saying? A week or two. She gonna come with this one. So y'all, I said they about a week or two apart. Once Hazel get here, a week after that, we should be seeing Roxy's a few days after that, we should be seeing the time. But if they all come around the same day, I know that they're still healthy because they all within the same time frame. Um, if I was dealing with micros and, and, and shit like that, uh, nanos, whatever they, whatever they call those, I would go do more, uh, I'd be going to do reverse progesterone and, and shit like that on the dog so I can get more of an accurate day, ac calculated day um, to retrieve those puppies. As y'all know, these are XL, so as far as C-sections and all that, it's not really one of those things that you have to do. Um, so yeah, man, if you're interested in a puppy from Roxy, make sure you hit me up at 206-499-0422. The number again is 206-499-0422. If you're interested in a puppy from Junior and Hazel, that number again is 206-499-0422. I am taking deposits. I'm taking four more deposits. I've already took three deposits on Hazel and Junior. I'm taking four more. I kind of wanted to keep it limited. Okay, I just want to keep it limited because if I decide to keep more than one, I still want to give myself room to be able to keep more than one. So I don't want to sell all the slots because I'm not selling. The, I'm not selling the whole litter like I did on my previous litter. I just needed to put those dogs out there to see what they look like. And now I've seen that they look amazing. That they looking at the standard I want. I'm putting the right shit together and I'm creating a better dog.